Hey guys, Dimani here with another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. So in today's video, we will have double fan art, one up top, one on the side. So thank you so much guys for sending that in. Um, like I said, I did open up all, all the drawings to all anime. So if you guys want to send in Naruto, Bleach, One Piece, uh, Fairy Tale, whatever you guys want to send in, uh, feel free to do so, okay? So the, the email is now demontiart at gmail.com. So I made a separate email just for fan art to make it a little easier to check and uh, you know pull those out for videos. So if you guys want to send it over, I'll make sure to show it for you, all right? Okay, so in today's video, um, I actually <laughs> I actually farmed quite a few metals, quite a few metals. Actually, let me just go do it this way. Jeez, all right, here we go. So I farmed 182 uh, Mass Saiyan medals. That is actually the exact number that you need to awaken every single Mass Saiyan, AKA Bardock, um, spoiler alert, <laughs> in the game. So guys, uh, make sure to go ma uh, farm 182 of them. That's the amount that you need. Um, I'm not sure if any LRs need Mass Saiyan medals. So you might even need more than that, but 182 is what you need for the awakenings of all the cards. So guys, I'm just gonna hop right into it, and uh, we're gonna awaken four cards in this video. We're gonna talk about which ones I think is the best awakening, uh, which ones, if you're gonna raise one super attack, which ones it is gonna be. Um, so we'll get we'll get into everything, okay? All right, so the first card we're gonna do is the bomb diggity right here. Mass Saiyan, uh, what, what is his name? Shrouded in Mysteries. Woo! Uh, so I kind of I found it kind of funny that if they released this guy in October. Maybe they thought he was a little bit more scary for October Halloween time. I don't even know. Friday the Thirteenth, you know. Um, anyways, uh, his passive is going to increase uh, on this one. From I'm waiting for it to show. I believe it's forty thousand to start. Yeah. So attack forty thousand and attack uh, and defense plus fifteen thousand when facing two or less enemies. Uh, I believe that's jumping up to fifty thousand and twenty thousand respectively. He's also gaining first battle. And uh, nothing else really changes on him, I believe. So let's go ahead and hop into the Awakening. Let me just double check that. I do like the card art a lot better on the second, like him covering his face. It's pretty badass. And yep, I believe that was correct. Attack uh, plus 50,000 and defense 20,000 gain first battle. I find it really weird that he has over 9,000. Uh, that's kind of a, just like a rant. Oh, that's prepared, ba prepared for battle. That's kind of a really random length for him. Like the only units that really have that is Nappa, Vegeta, and for some reason Champa. Champa has it, and then Mass Saiyan. I don't know. <laughs> uh, no answers there, guys. No answers there. It's cool. Whatever. Uh, so gonna go ahead and Doken Awaken this guy. Um, I will be maxing out a super attack with Elder Kai's. Uh, maybe do a damage test on that. Um, one thing I'm a little afraid on this unit, I'm not sure. Those that have him maxed out in the dupe system, let me know what you think about him. Um, is he worth orbs? Most people, you know, most units passives that are worth, like, great for orbs, you know, is 70% up on attack, 100% up on attack, you know, w when doing super attack. This man is just 50, 50,000 flat. So, he gets a lot less benefit from the nuke system than I think other units do. Uh, so guys, let me know in the comments, uh, if you notice the big increase, you know, those that maxed him out, I'd love to hear your, your input on that. Okay, so anyways, that was the first unit right there. Uh, Mass Saiyan is awoken. Uh, next one we're gonna do is this man, Bardock. One of what one of my favorite units in the game. It actually took me a really long time to pull this guy. Uh, he causes supreme damage, seals super attack. So he is one of the few sealers that we have in the game. Uh, changes strength key uh, to tech key and attack plus twenty percent. So um, I believe once you doken him, the only thing that changes is he gets fierce battle. Fierce battle on this unit is absolutely amazing because the entire team, the Mono Tech team for Super Saiyan Three Goku has. Pretty much has fierce battle, so it's great that he's gonna have it too. Um, so let me click that. <clears throat> click that. I really hope I found enough medals. I hope my math was correct on that. Uh, so there we go. So he has fierce battle and attack plus forty percent. Um, so that's actually quite a, quite an increase right there. Um, really excited to use him with max super attack. I'm kind of curious to see how much damage he's gonna do. I would see. I would say in the rank of things, guys, um, this guy is probably ranked either number one or two uh, as far as the Doken Awakenings for the Bardocks, uh, and we'll go over that, uh, which one I think is overall best here in a second. All right, so we're just gonna hop right into it. Doken Awaken, Doken Awaken. Uh, how I waited for this. Nice, 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 nice. I would say farming that event that many times was that like. 20 something times uh, to get all the medals was very tedious. Um, so, uh, I, these units are very worth it though. So, that's awesome. Doken Awaken. I actually really like the card art for the Doken Awaken. I thought the original was actually very good as well on this one. Uh, but the Doken Awaken uh, card art is not bad at all. Alright, so we got two other ones. Uh, that one right there, I'm actually going to rank it rank two or rank one. Uh, the rank one and two are pretty tied. Let's go do rank uh, the other one that I'm talking about. 
the strength one. So this one right here, the card, actually, hold on. You guys gotta see this, hold up, let me just uh, do this. This is one of the biggest Dokkan Awakenings uh, you've ever seen in Dokkan Battle. Damn it, I did it again. You just gotta clip, hold on it, you gotta hold on it. Okay, so the way this card started out, Super Saiyan 1, it started out Super Saiyan 1. All allies attack plus 15% when HP is 50% 50 or above. Not very good at all. Not very good at all. 15% is very, it's like one key link. Uh, not very optimal whatsoever. Um, Saiyan Pride, Team Bardock, Family Tree, Super Saiyan, Saiyan Warrior Race. I mean, back in the day, his links were very good. This card was very strong. He's fallen off very quick. Um, so with this Doken Awakening, this is one of the most dramatic changes I've ever seen. With this Doken Awakening, I gotta sneeze. <sighs> Try not to let it out during the video. With this Doken Awakening, he goes Super Saiyan 2. So I love the card out. Out of the Bardox, this is probably my favorite card art uh, from the Doken. Uh, actually, yeah, it's not a rebirth. This one, is, he has first battle. So I guess it is a Dokkan, right? I know people, a lot of, a lot of people Hakai me like, it's not a, it's not a Dokkan Awakening, it's a rebirth. I'm like, whatever. All right, so anyways, attack 30% for, uh, for all allies. So he went from 15% to 30%. That's actually quite the jump uh, for all allies when HP is 30% or above. So now this man is boosting Super Saiyan 4 Goku's attack by 30%. When all, he's basically a third rotation slot character. Um, he will actually have a spot on my mono strength team. And he also raises attack for six turns when doing a super attack. Uh, he gained prepared for battle, which is great for mono strength. And then he also gained fierce battle. So, um, actually, did he, did he get, he did not get the first Awoken. So I was thinking if he got the first Awoken, then I was thinking about maybe running the str Strength God Q with him, would actually be kind of cool, but he did not get the first Awoken. That's all right. Anyways, gonna awaken this guy. So that is the third unit Awoken right here. And you know what? Uh, those are the two best ones right here. I'm gonna say this is number one. Uh, number two is probably the tech one. Very, very close though. Very, very close though. Let me know what you guys think. I'm actually really curious. I'm gonna leave a little poll right above me. It has a little eye. Click on it and uh, leave, leave a vote. Which one do you think is better, the strength or the tech? I'm curious to see what you guys see. Uh, let me know in the comments, okay? All right, and guys, we do have one more awakening. Uh, before, uh, before I end this, I also wanna say, you can use the the, the the AGL Bardocks. I'm sure you guys have seen them. They're, 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 it's featured on the banner, actually, the AGL Bardocks to raise all these guys' super attack. And that is what I did to max all these guys out. Um, so we got physical. Boom, right there. So actually, let me show you what he looks like first before we awaken. Cause extreme damage and steal super attack. So he is another sealer. The, the tech and the physical are both sealers. The strength is not. If, if one were to be better than the other, the, the only reason some people might say the mono tech is better is because he seals also. So he has that going for him. But strength, strength team could really use a sealer, but 30% buff on uh, Super Saiyan 4 Goku is freaking insane. So yeah, let me know. Let me know, guys. Vote, vote, vote. Tech or strength? Tech or strength? This guy is decent as well, but um, unfortunately, there is a better unit for mono physical, and that is a sealer. That is uh, physical go tanks, who causes. I believe it's supreme damage and 100% damage increase as well. Uh, so key plus two for all allies when HP is 50% or above. That's before he dokons. And then once you doke on him, boom. So we had exactly the right amount of medals. This one's all right. Now blow to the face. Uh, causes supreme damage and steal super attack. So same thing. But he gained fierce battle. And this one actually has the first awaken. Key plus two attack 20% for all allies when HP is 30% or above. So this one also boosts key. Um, with a mono physical when God Tanks comes, this guy might actually be kind of harmful. Uh, for all allies when HP is 30% or above, and then also the uh, the 25% attack up. Or I'm sorry, 20% attack up. Uh, so this one actually has the first awaken. This was the one I was looking for on the um, on the uh, strength version, the Super Saiyan 2 strength version, because this guy was actually pretty decent and with this. This is a big link. This is one of the biggest links in the game. 25% um, for the first awaken but only a handful of units actually use them, or actually have that link. Uh, for physical, <laughs> for physical, the only other physical unit that has it is Piccolo, so you're not really gonna benefit at all from the first Awaken on this one right here. Uh, you know what? Seeing this more, I forgot the first Awaken. If you have LR Goku, also the first Awaken, the first Awaken is on LR Goku, so the, the tech one might actually be better. It's a close tie between the tech and the strength, I'm actually, after, after doing this video, I might actually lean more towards the tech one. Again, guys, vote, 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 vote. Let me know which one you like better, tech or strength. Physical does not even uh, belong up there, even though he is a good unit. Does not belong up there. Uh, let's awaken the last one right here. Yes! 
All right, and one YOLO for the road. Okay, so 182 medals, all for Mass Sane, aka Bardock's Awaken. That card art's not bad. Um, I actually like the original better though. I kind of like the the you know punch of the screen. Uh, very cool card. But uh, would I ever actually use it? I don't think so. I don't think you'd have a spot on my team. Uh, so gonna do one YOLO, and then we're gonna get out of here, guys. All Mass Saiyans. And now it's crazy how many units they release with this uh, with this update. Now I gotta do Super Saiyan threes. I think you need another 182 medals. Let's see. You need 77 for Super Saiyan three Angel, and then you need the physical, the tech, and then there's the Super Saiyan two tech. So yeah, it's the same thing. 182 medals. That's insane. That's insane. All right, guys, one yellow to end the video. Me versus you. If you want to do the yellow with me, let me know in the comments what you guys pulled. Always a fist fight between me and you. Um, I pulled. Nice, nice. It's going super sane. I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat you. That's my goal is to beat you. Let's go. Um, I pulled Nappa. <laughs> so if you pulled something stronger than Nappa, aka animated muscle, the boy. Uh, let me know in the comments, guys. I want to know what you pulled. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video. Do me a solid. Leave a like on your way out. And I'll get, catch you guys in the next one. Later.